I think all of the volunteers for a period of time got some feeling, a bit of a feeling of what it's like to be black in a white society. Uh, a very frightening at that time white society, a very unjust, a society where you could be slapped, jailed, killed, literally, with very little, if any, recourse. I had no concept of anything like that. And my guess is 99% of the volunteers who went down there didn't either. My experience within that war, I mean, that was a part of it. That's, that was what it was all kind of sitting on, was people getting their heads knocked in and skulls broken open and shot and murdered and stuff. But that wasn't my experience. My experience was uh, uh, also the opposite, incredible sweetness, joy, learning. Uh, yeah, just quite extraordinary. I suppose you hear people who have been in a war like soldiers and sometimes they say, you know, yes, there was that, but you know, I had buddies and we had this and it was extraordinary. Um, and so there was, you know, we were in a war, in a sense, but uh, a lot of joyousness. The two communities, black and white, really did come together. I mean, we, we had, that's all we had was each other. And it was, we were all working for the same purpose. And I don't know if there's ever been a time since then that that's come about in such a intimate way. I mean, we were living together, we were eating together, we were, you know, meeting together, we were sharing the same risks together. <laughs> <laughs>